Namaste and peace and blessings. I would like to thank you so much for joining me here today. I ask that you find yourself in a comfortable seated pose. Any seated pose that feels good for you. May you find that seat. Maybe we can take a nice, deep, intentional breath in. Hold in the breath. Exhale through the mouth. Softly gazing downward towards the earth. Maybe closing our eyes if that feels comfortable for us. Inhale. Exhale. Noticing how your shoulders relax downward away from your ears. Maybe we notice how our bodies become more centered and focused here with the breath and the down gaze. Bringing our palms together at heart center. Continuing to gaze down. Becoming more aware of our present moment. Shoulders are back nice and tall. Spinal cord is nice and long. Our tummy is nice and tight. Inhale, exhale. Spinal twist right side, softly gazing over that right shoulder, feeling our spinal cord relaxing here. We'll hold this pose for four breaths. Exhale and back to center. Spinal twist opposite side, gazing over that left shoulder. Exhale and back to center. Placing our palms behind our bodies. Our palms are feeling the energies and the vibrations of the universe being aware of our environment around us. Inhale, exhale through the mouth. Leaning our bodies towards the sides, feeling that side bend here. Lifting our left arm up in the air, nice and high. Left arm flows over the head as our body leans deeper to the right. Going down as much as we comfortably can. We'll hold this pose for five breaths. Exhaling back to center. Both palms on the floor. Right arm comes up in the air as our bodies lean towards the left. Arm goes above the head. Going deeper into that left bend. Going down as much as we comfortably can. Holding this pose. Five breaths. Exhaling back to center. Palms up on the earth. Feeling the energies of our mind. Feeling the energies of our environment. Breathe in. Breathe out. Make me straighten our legs in front of us, finding our bodies in a staff pose. Legs are forward, shoulders up, spinal cord nice and long. Breathe in, exhaling forward, seated forward fold. Feeling our bodies bend here, feeling the stretch behind our legs and our hamstring. Allowing our torso and head to flow downward towards our legs. We'll hold this pose four breaths. Exhale. 
Have seated forward fold, slightly gazing forward, back is straight. Exhale, back to staff pose. Shoulders nice and tall. Lifting our right leg in the air, crossing it over our left leg. Seated twist, right side, bringing our left elbow over our right knee, feeling this, feeling this twist nice and deep as we gaze over that right shoulder. Exhaling back to center, coming back to our staff, bending forward, seated forward fold. Coming back up to our staff pose. Lifting up that left foot, crossing it over our right leg, taking our right elbow, placing it over that left knee, gazing over that left shoulder, feeling this spinal twist here. Exhaling back to center, seated forward fold. Coming back up to our staff pose, lifting up that right leg, right foot is flat on the floor. We're gonna work on our Sage Marici. Right arms in the air, leaning towards the left, leaning forward as we wrap that right arm around our right leg. Taking our left arm behind our backs, interlacing our fingers, feeling this stretch, side twist. We'll hold this for four breaths. Exhale, uninterlacing the fingers, unwrapping that leg, coming back to our staff pose, forward fold. Exhale back to staff, bending that left foot. Left foot is flat on the floor. Left arm goes up in the air. Lean to the right, leaning forward. Allowing that left arm to wrap around that left leg. Bringing that right arm behind our backs. Interlacing our fingers, feeling a stretch, feeling the side bend here. We're gonna hold this for four breaths. Exhale, uninterlacing those fingers, unwrapping that leg. Staff pose, forward fold. Holding this pose, four breaths. Breathing back to our staff pose, finding our bodies in our tabletop. Ensuring that our hands are beneath our shoulders, knees or hip distance apart, dropping down to our cow. Exhaling to our cat. Breathing back to our cow. Feeling our curvature here in our spine, slight back bend. Exhale to cat. Coming back to table, bringing our right leg towards the back. Nice and high, left arm goes forward, bird pose. Tummy is nice and tight, feeling our body's balance here, feeling our arms strengthen. We're gonna hold this pose for breaths. Two more breaths. Exhale, knee to elbow, back to bird. Knee to elbow, back to bird. Knee to elbow, back to bird. Holding a pose, two more breaths. Exhale, tabletop. Drop into our cow. Exhale to our cat. Coming back to our table, bringing that left leg to the back, bird pose opposite side. Right arm goes forward. Tummy's nice and tight. Feeling the body balance. Strengthening our arm. Two more breaths. Exhale, knee to elbow. Back to bird. 
knee to elbow, back to bird, knee to elbow, back to bird, exhale to table, pushing our bodies up to our down dog, gazing back at our feet, breathing up to our up dog, feeling our body strengthen, our arms are getting nice and strong, exhale down dog. Mm. Breathing forward to a high plank, building strength, holding his pose, tummy's nice and tight. Walking our arms closer towards our ribs. Coming down, chaturanga. Hovering over our yoga mat. Exhale, cobra. Mm. So in the back bend here, breathe up dog. Exhale, down dog. Three-legged dog, right side. Right leg goes in the air, nice and high. Feeling a stretch. Right foot goes to left buttocks. Flowing over to our wild thing. Feeling a stretch. Holding his pose, four breaths. Breathe back, down dog. Breathe up, dog. Breathe back, down, dog. Three-legged dog, opposite side, left legs in the air, nice and high. Bending left foot to right buttocks. Flowing over to the wild thing. We'll hold this for a breath. Exhale back, down dog. <sighs> Breathe up dog, building strength here. Exhale, high plank. Two more breaths. Slowing down, chaturanga. Exhale, cobra. <sighs> Breathe up dog. Exhale, wide-legged child's pose. Relaxing here, hanging out in his pose. Five breaths. Gazing forward, walking our fingers to the front of the yoga mat, feeling a stretch here. <sighs> Waving our bodies, doing a couple of spinal waves. <sighs> feeling our spinal cord working here and relaxing. As we flow to our tabletop pose, <sighs> ensuring our hands are underneath our shoulders. We're gonna work on our thread and needle. Right arm comes out to the side. 30 net right arm towards the left, 30 net right arm through the left. Body comes down towards the earth. We can hold this pose or we can go deeper by lifting our left arm in the air and wrapping that left arm around our backs. We'll hold this pose for breaths. Slowly unwrapping that arm, unthreading that needle back to our table, dropping down to our cow. Exhale to our cat. Coming back to our table. Thread the needle left side, left arm goes in the knee, comes out to the side. Left arm threads through the right, body goes down. We can go deeper by wrapping our arm around our back if we choose. We'll hold this pose for breaths.
unwrapping that arm, unthreading that needle back to our table. <clears throat> Dropping down to our cow. Exhale to our cat. Coming back to our table. Allowing our buttocks to come towards our heels of our feet. We are in our hero's pose. <sighs> Holding this pose, noticing how we feel. Bringing our arms above our heads and our salute. Palms together. Exhale down to prayer hands. Breathing up to our nail position. We are nailed on our nails. We are nailed on our knees. Placing our hands at the lower parts of our back. Maybe lifting our shoulders up towards our ears. Shrugging our shoulders towards the back. We're working on a couple of shoulder rolls here. If this feels good, maybe we can work on a camel by allowing our shoulders and our head to fall to the back as our chest comes forward. Seeing how deep we can go in our camel, we'll hold this pose five to six breaths. Exhaling back up to our kneel position. <sighs> Breathing down, back to hero's pose. Coming forward, finding ourselves in our puppy pose. Hands go forward, buttocks come slightly up in the air. We're gonna hold this pose for breaths. Slightly gazing forward, walking our hands forward, feeling a stretch. As we do a couple of spinal waves. <sighs> Finding our bodies back in our table. Pushing our bodies up to our down dog. Three-legged dog, right side, right legs in the air. Right foot, right hand, runner's lunge. Coming up to our pyramid, feeling a stretch. Leaning forward over that front leg, feeling that extended stretch. Coming up to our fingertips, gazing forward. Bending our knee back to our runner's lunge. <sighs> Exhale, down dog. Three-legged dog, opposite side. Left legs in the air. Left foot, left hand, runner's lunge, opposite side. Straighten up that front leg, pyramid. Leaning forward over that front leg, extended stretch. Coming up on our fingertips, gazing forward. Bending that front leg back to our runner's lunge. Exhale, down dog. <sighs> Holding this pose. Feeling how our body's still here in our down dog. Flowing forward to our high plank, building strength, holding a pose. Exhale, side plank. Now we're not wanting to come up in the air. Exhale down, back to high plank. Side plank, opposite side. Arm goes in the air. Exhale, down dog, feeling the stretch. <sighs> Waving our bodies to our wide-legged child's pose. We'll hold this pose for breaths. Gazing forward, couple of spinal waves. Pushing our body up to our down dog. Gazing back at our feet, ensuring that our palms of our hands are flat on the yoga mat. As we jump our bodies up or walk our bodies forward into our standing forward fold. Leaning over, noticing how this feels. Maybe we can flow into a ragdoll, 
holding our elbows from side to side, leaning completely forward here. Exhale back, forward fold. Coming up on our fingertips, slightly gazing forward, filling our back, getting straight. Exhale, forward fold. Breathing back up to our fingertips, slightly gazing forward, breathing to our half forward fold, hands right beneath the knees. Shoulders are straight, back is long, gazing forward. Exhale, Tadasana. Palms are at our side. We are in our mountain pose. Breathe. Stand in salute. Exhale. Stand in prayer. Breathing to our dancer's pose. Left leg comes towards the back. Right hand goes forward. Still in our body. Strengthen here and balance here in our dancer's pose. We'll hold this six breaths. Breathing back down, Tadasana. Exhale, salute. Breathing to a standing prayer. Gazing downward. Dancer's pose, opposite side. Right leg goes towards the back. Left arm goes forward. Feeling our body's balance. We're gonna hold this six breaths. Breathing out, back into our Tadasana. Exhale, standing salute, standing prayer, half forward fold, holding this pose, filling the stretch behind our hamstrings, gazing forward, back is straight. Exhale, complete forward fold. Mm -hmm. Hanging out here for four breaths. Maybe we can pedal our feet and I can be forward fold. Listen how this feels. Coming forward to our down dog. Breathing up to our up dog. Feeling a stretch, feeling a strength. Hovering over our ribs. Going down to our chaturanga. Hanging out here. Exhale, cobra. Ensuring our shoulders are away from our ears. We're not up here. We are down there. Holding this pose, filling the back bend. Exhale, up dog. Breathe down dog. Three-legged dog, right side. Right foot to right hand, runner's lunge as we flow to our warrior two. Feeling our body strengthen here. Exhale, reverse warrior. Breathe into our extended side angle. Back to our warrior two. Breathe forward, warrior one, or high lunge. Back to warrior two. Coming back to warrior one. Leaning forward, runner's lunge, straightening out their front leg, pyramid. Hmm. Coming back to that runner's lunge, exhale, down dog. Three-legged dog, opposite side. Left foot, left hand, runner's lunge. Flow into our warrior two. <sighs> Feeling the body strengthen. <sighs> warrior one or high lunge. Exhale back to warrior two. Breathing back, reverse warrior. Extended side angle. Back to warrior one or high lunge. 
coming up to our pyramid. Hmm. Run this line, bending that front knee. Exhale, down dog. Flowing up to our high plank, holding a high plank. Exhale, side plank, arms up in the air, nice and tall. Feeling our body's balance. <sighs> Exhale, high plank. As we flow, side plank. <sighs> Holding this pose. Breathing down to our down dog. Exhale into our wide legged child's pose. We're gonna hang out here for 10, for 10 breaths. I have to charge my laptop, it's about to die. So hang out in child's pose for a couple breaths. Gazing forward in that child's pose, walking our fingers to the front of the mat, feeling a stretch. Waving our bodies, doing a couple of spinal waves. As we flow back to our table, bird pose, right side, right leg goes to the back, left arm goes forward. Tummy's nice and tight. Exhale back to table. Bird pose, opposite side, left leg goes towards the back. Right arm goes forward. Exhale back to table. Crushing our bodies up to our down dog. Three-legged dog, right side, right legs in the air, nice and high. Right foot, right hand, runner's lunge, walking our right leg to the edge of the yoga mat. Bringing our right arm inside of our leg, preparing our body for lizard, dropping down to our knee if we choose as we go inward on our forearms, relaxing our torso inside of our leg. We're going to hang out here in lizard for five breaths. Coming down to that knee if he was off, pushing your body up, staying in our lizard. We're going to bend that back knee and lift our right arm up in the air. Still in the sides, stretch here. Exhaling back down. Leg comes forward. Opposite side, we're going to twist our bodies. Lifting that left arm up in the air, feeling the twist. Gazing upwards at that left arm. Breathing back down, exhale, down dog. Three-legged dog, left legs in the air. Left foot, left hand, runner's lunge. <sighs> Walking our left foot towards the edge of the mat. Bringing our left arm inside of our bodies. Coming down to our lizard pose. Coming on our forearms, noticing how our bodies relax inward inside of our leg. We can be on our knee or we can come up off that knee. We're gonna hang out here in lizard for five breaths. Dropping down to that knee, pushing our body slightly up as we lean, twist towards the right, allowing our right arm to come up in the air, gazing upwards at that right arm. We're gonna hold this pose for a couple breaths. <sighs> Exhaling exhale, exhale, that one down. <sighs> Allowing our bodies to twist to the opposite side. Left arm comes up in the air, gazing up at that left arm. Exhaling back forward. Breathe, down dog. Coming up to our high plank. Coming down to our chaturanga. Exhale into our cobra. So in the back bend here, shoulders are away from the ears. Exhale in the child's pose, hanging out here for five breaths. 
Noticing how this feels in our body. Doing a couple of spinal waves here. Decompressing our spinal cord. Noticing how this feels. Finding our bodies at pause in our table. Allowing our bodies to fall towards our backs. Crossing our feet. Coming into our seated position. Maybe we're sitting in an easy seat. Tummy is tight. Shoulders are nice and tall. Spinal cord is nice and long. Exhale, seated, twist, right side. Coming back to center. Seated, twist, opposite side. Coming back to center. <sighs> Doing a couple of shoulder shrugs. Shoulders up to the wards, the ears going towards the back. We'll do a couple of these. <sighs> Finding our pause, rotating forward. <sighs> Noticing how this feels within our bodies. Ensuring we're not moving too fast. We're working on self-care here. We're not in a rush, taking our time, focusing on self. Finding pause. Breathing our palms above our heads, seated salute. Exhale, seated prayer. Bringing our feet in front of us in our butterfly pose. Our bottoms of our feet are together. Noticing how this feels in our hips. Maybe we can hold on to the bottoms of our feet and bring our chest forward. We are doing a butterfly cow. And we can do a butterfly cat by allowing our spinal cord to go towards the back and our chin to come towards our chest. Coming back to cow, chest comes forward, chin comes up. Feeling this, the curvature here, feeling our back bend. Ah, oh, relaxing. Noticing how this feels in our spinal cord as we exhale back to our cat pose. Breathing back to our cow, noticing how this feels. Coming back to center, we are back. And our butterfly. Maybe we can lean forward, noticing how this feels in our hips. This is a hip opener here. Holding this pose, four breaths. Breathing up. Walking our feet slightly away from our body, finding ourselves now in our diamond pose. Now leaning forward, diamond pose, forward fold. Maybe we'll notice how our torso and head can go closer to the earth. We'll hold this pose five breaths. Pushing our bodies up. Allowing our hands to bring our knees together. Crossing our feet, if we choose, or just bringing our feet up, we're gonna go into a boat pose. Lifting our feet forward, bringing our arms parallel to our lower legs, ensuring that our abdominal muscles are nice and tight. Feeling our body's balance here. We'll hold this boat pose five breaths. Two more breaths. Keeping our legs in the air, we're going to reach down and grab our feet with our hands. <sighs> Noticing how this feels. We're going to work on a boat pose variation. Some people also call this bear pose. We're going to allow our left foot to come out towards the side. Feeling that stretch here. If this feels fine, we're going to allow our right foot to come out towards the side. Noticing how this feels in our bodies. Tummy's nice and tight, feeling our bodies balance. Maybe we can allow our legs to come further towards the side, looking like a V, as much as we comfortably can. <sighs> Two more breaths.
bringing our knees in, bottoms of our feet come together, coming down to our butterfly. Okay, so hanging out here in our butterfly pose. Two more breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Noticing how our bodies feel. Using our hands to bring our knees together. Coming back to the side, dropping our bodies down. We're gonna bring our knees towards our chest. Hanging out here, knees to chest pose. And then come up. <sighs> Hugging our knees into our chest. Maybe we can rock our body from side to side. Massaging our spinal cord with the earth. Finding pause. Lifting our legs up in the air. Pointing our feet if we choose. Allowing our legs to come towards the side. Reclined wide legged splits here. Using our hands to bring our legs towards the side. <sighs> Noticing how this feels in our body. Bringing our legs back together, knees back to our chest. We're gonna do a recline spinal twist, left side, allowing our knees to fall towards the left. Right arm goes out to the side like a T as we gaze over that right shoulder, feeling the spinal twist here, feeling that spinal cord relax and decompress. Maybe we can allow our shoulders to fall backwards into the yoga mat, completely relaxing our bodies. We'll hang out here for five breaths. Coming back to center, knees to chest. Inhale. Exhale, recline, spinal twist, opposite side. Knees come towards the right. Arm comes out to the side, gazing over that left shoulder. Allowing our bodies to completely relax here. Noticing our shoulders relaxing backwards into the yoga mat. We're gonna hold this pose for a couple more breaths. Coming back to center, knees to chest, hugging our knees into our chest. Lifting our knees up in the air, reaching down to the lower parts of our legs. Using our hands to bring our legs towards our torso. Feeling the stretch, we're gonna hold this pose, four breaths. Legs back up in the air. Allowing our knees to fall towards our chest. Now allowing our feet to fall towards the floor. Our knees are up in the air. We're gonna work on a bridge pose. Allowing our feet to push our buttocks up in the air, noticing how our hips and buttocks comes high up. We are in our bridge pose. Coming back down, coming back up in our bridge. We are working our gluteus maximus here. We can go deeper in this pose by bringing our hands underneath our buttocks and backs and interlacing our fingers and walking our shoulder blades towards our spinal cord. Noticing that our chest and hips comes even higher in the air. We're gonna hold this pose five breaths. Exhaling, relaxing our bodies here, bringing our knees back towards our chest, legs back up in the air, reaching down to the bottoms of our legs, 
bringing our legs towards our torso, feel in a stretch. Legs back in the air. Knees to chest. Straightening out that right leg. Now straightening out that left leg. We are now in our Tadasana. If we want to find a blanket to cover up with, may we do so. Wrapping our bodies if we choose. Using the warmth to help us become centered. Our legs are side by side. The heels of our feet are touching. Maybe we can allow our feet to fall to the side, completely relaxing our legs. Allowing our shoulders to fall backwards into the yoga mat. Closing our eyes or gazing our eyes down, whichever feels best for you. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Do them out. We use the next couple moments to relax here in silence. Don't wait anything. Maybe we can slowly turn on our side, finding ourselves in our fetal pose. We'll hang out here for a couple more seconds. Noticing how this feels, keeping our eyes closed or gaze down. Maybe we can slowly wiggle our toes and rotate our ankles. Moving our hips and our torso. Allowing the movements to awaken our bodies. Inhale. Exhale. Pushing our bodies up. Finding ourselves in our seated pose. <laughs> Gazing downward towards the earth. Bringing our palms together at heart center. Inhale. Exhale. I would like to thank you for allowing me to guide you here today. It truly was a pleasure. The light in me sees, appreciates, and respects the light in you. Namaste.